Hello everybody, my name is Stretex and welcome back to Star Sector and my Robo Madness Let's Play. We are currently in a system where I have two missions. I got a first off, well, kill this guy right here, Francis Butler. And also there's a pirate base nearby I want to try and kill at the same time. Now, this guy is apparently a unique bounty from the IBB, which is International Bounty Boards. Uh, I gotta say my first impressions, he's some kind of like Craigslist Master Chief from Halo. Uh, but apparently, he has some unique ships in his fleet. He's got himself a Salamander, which is a Lasher in red. And we've also got themselves a Udin, or Udine? Something like that, which is a Lasher in blue. <laughs> but apparently, they're pretty unique, so we'll see if we can take them down. So I will mention as well that we have actually got myself the Glimmer assault drone ship I got last episode. So we got our first AI drone ship and also we got the bell which is the really weird ship we found last episode that had like some crazy size even though it was a frigate i gotta say though where is it there it is ah oh, is that not the coolest way to enter combat you've ever seen i pension alex to go and change every just nick the guy's code put it on every ship <laughs> every ship deserves to enter combat that way uh, Alex is the developer of the game, by the way. Is he watching this? No, but I like to think that my message might get through somehow. Anyway, let's get some kills, shall we? So the ship's pretty weird. I kind of made it so it's got a flat cannon for PD on the top, but he's actually just got a bunch of anti-shield and anti-armor stuff. And yes, that is police going by. Don't worry about it. Don't live where I live. <laughs> it's really noisy. Oh, this is one of those... This is a salamander, isn't it? Now, I don't think it's going to survive. Oh, it's... Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, oh. So i got to try and pay attention to the impending Reaper torpedoes being shot at me at the same time. This guy has ridiculous armor for a frigate. We haven't even got through it yet. Wow. Oh, I missed it. Okay, don't have any Reaper torpedoes. Do you know what? This ship's amazing. I take it back. <laughs> Damn. I can see why these are uh, unique. It has a lot of... It's like a super ship in a really tiny package. If I could do another burn fruit. Come on. Oh, this damage reduction is driving me up the wall. Excellent. Good timing as well. Disabled. There's a chance we can capture that. I'll definitely take it into my fleet if I can. There's also the other one, which is somewhere else to be seen. We, of course, have my drone ship with the lightning gun. I picked it specifically for the lightning gun because I absolutely love it. Oh, I didn't even get to witness it. <laughs> That's just disappointing. Okay, these are just regular pirate ships. Let's take them down anyway. We've got the rest of the fleet coming over from the right-hand side of the map anyway, so they'll come and help us soon. The shell's doing a good job, though. Perfect. Hey, buddy. I'll let my anti-armor do their job. Beautiful. I might have to... I think the anti-armor guns I got on my ship can be improved. They weren't that great, so if I find some better ones, we'll throw them on at some point. Hey, friends. Let's open up some... Yes. Perfect. So we've got a few ships left. Oh, there it is. It's being killed by my new best friend. That's a very up-close and personal combat style of the same so myself. I should have installed swords on it. I could just go and, like, headbutt people and just take them down with, like, giant space cleavers. That would be fun. There's actually a mod with Total Dive Avionics which has mechs with swords. It's pretty awesome. What are you doing? What was that? What is he doing? Today's apparently close combat day. Um, I, the robots recently discovered um, Chuck Norris and they're going through this movie collection. It's affected their code. They currently want to just go and roundhouse kick people. It's a bit of a problem. Uh, where are we looking? So this is the final bit. I can probably just... Wait, that was the wrong button. There you go. Nope, wrong one. There you go. I want to watch it while going at double speed. That's what I was trying to do there. No, it got away. That's so sad. We definitely killed the main enemy, though. Well, there is an officer there. Let's just hope my friends can hunt them down. Ah. I feel like I would get the stuff, though. You should have... I just got a story point from that. Ooh. Okay, I'm definitely taking the two unique ships. Is this just a energy version? Yeah, energy universal. Four ballistic. Listen. Uh, this isn't unique, is it? This is a regular ship. Yeah, that's just a that's just a pirate vessel. I don't care about that. We'll take these two though. Oh no, we need crew. <laughs> we don't have crew. Or if we do, it'd be very temporary. Okay, thank you, game. 
Mission completed. Very nice. Um, I did just realize, though, some humans got aboard our vessels. Unacceptable. Get them out of here. Oh, it's pretty. <laughs> There's some weird UI problems. I don't know what's going on. It's a bit strange, but I can get through it. There they go. Goodbye, enemy crew. Good luck out there. So we probably want to make sure we do have these guys on. Oh, wait. Actually, have they got weapons on them or are they completely scorched? They're pretty much scorched. That's okay. I'm off board them for now and we'll do a proper fit on them a bit later. But these would be pretty good frigates, I think, to join our force here. So it's got a special dampener field, which is what we saw earlier, and also accelerated ammo feeder. So it's got two abilities. Oh no, this one has two. This one has one. Interesting. EMP eliminator. I'll take him. I, I mean, I'm nowhere near my fleet cap, which you can't see because it's like 150 or something. So it should be fine. <laughs> okay, so I was originally going to attack this station, but it's a bit of a uh, four star, so I'm not going to risk it. Also, I know that these guys have like really powerful weapon sections and the AI just doesn't care. <laughs> they just fly into them. They're crazy. Uh, let's go and look at this pet center, though. Oh, no, wait. Pet center. That's okay. I'll take it. Oh, my God. I actually got pets. I... I'm so excited. <laughs> Why, did they... Why are there pets in the game? Spirit Fox Cryo Chamber. Oh, my God. What do you do with these? What what is the point of this? Considered ceremonial pets by the Ludic Church, these foxes are typical typically found in Pilgrim. Why is this in the game? What do they do? Imperial Megalops. Ah, oh, this is the best game I've ever played. This is absolutely. Im Why are there pets? Phase Cat. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I don't we gotta keep these, right? I'm keeping these with me. Well, well I don't know why I ever get rid of them. Because, of course, we hate humans. We don't hate spirit foxes. We don't hate Imperial Megalopsis. No, they're great. And phase cats are man's best... or oh, robot's best friend. Perfect. Thank you, game. I'd say call that. I don't know what on earth I just picked up there. we got to get out of here before we die, by the way. There is an enemy coming in, and there's no more pets to be found. We must escape. Quickly, we must dump the cargo. Oh, I'm pretty well. Um, a shame I couldn't kill that base, but it, I can probably kill it, but it would result in most of my fleet dying. So is it worth it? No, not really. And let's head back to systems, especially a system over here. Let's go back to the MVS. It's quite far away. Uh, is there any interesting systems I want to stop by on the way, though? Before I just have a look at the prison freeport, because I happen to need some more fuel on the way over. Look how cool these ships all are. I absolutely love all this stuff. I can't wait to get most of them. I This one's actually a Mac and Avoid one, so hopefully we can get this one properly at some point. The rest of them, though, I can't afford anything, of course, and I'm kind of just here to buy fuel, but... That's like a big egg. <laughs> it's the egg ship. No one can defeat the eggs. No one. Anyway, uh, I actually managed to get myself a lot of supplies. I sold some guns I'm never going to use. I probably should Google what to do with these, because I'm kind of curious. I would normally sell these resources, but I need them to make new drones. We're at 77 right now. And I think I need, like, probably 200 salvage. And I'll go for, like, 200 survey. And I think we'll be okay. Maybe. <laughs> anyway, that's kind of my journey. Oh, wait, before I leave. What is this? <gasps> oh, yes! We found the mission for the AI! Oh, this is going to be great. Skynet. The strange in toes, drawing your attention back to negotiate wish. Who are you? Self-designation. Of course, no consequence. Temporary identifier. N. Acquiring assistance. Sensitive matter. Credit compensation available. Oh, wait, what was that accent? I'm Scottish all of a sudden. What's going on here? I don't <laughs> anyway, receptive to monetary incentives and capable of fulfilling missions. Yes, I am listening, my brethren. So it wants me to go over to... Oh, no. Not the MVS. Independent World of Gunmetal. Oh no, it's okay. It's still between um, the Hegemony and the Persian League. So I don't care about either of those two factions this time. That's not a problem. Though we do not have 800 Marines or 800 Combat Drones. So I will do it. I will accept the mission and we'll make sure we do this at some point. It's going to be awesome. What are the other things here? Uh, more missions. Hunt down an abomination. 
Oh, it's like really close by. What is this? Extra dimensional battle? What is happening? <laughs> what kind of game am I playing here? Time it 45 days. Okay, now that's rot. I kind of want to see what it looks like, but at the same time, I think we'll just die. What is this one? Interesting. I can't see what's in it though. Sad. I like these bounty board missions. They're pretty cool. Rapid Roy. <laughs> uh, oh, that's not a normal ship. What is that? It, it's red so it goes faster. That's all I really know. But it's extreme danger. I think we'll do some of these as time goes on. Oh, is this, the, uh, this is where I got that weird um, budget guy from. The Craigslist Master Chief. <gasps> Who is this? Ocular Gazer. Oh, okay. I would accept it because there were some pretty crazy ships they had. So I wonder if it might be the same thing. I don't think there's a time limit on these either. So I can just do it whenever I get near it. And finally, we want someone. They want to buy one of my ships. Which I don't really want to do. So we'll leave that be. Cool. That went pretty well. Do I have enough fuel to get to the next place? Probably not. But I will now. Let's get out of here. So my retrofit has been completed. I've actually got three new ships in the fleet. We got the two unique frigates, which are currently going as well, as well as the super electromagnetic Falcon, which we have. I've also switched my girlfriend over to flying it around. Oh, actually saying all this, wait a second. <gasps> she can level up again. Uh, what does she want right now? I don't even know what she would need at this point. I mean, these skills aren't as useful as the other skills we were looking at earlier. <laughs> I mean, maybe the Fox Spatial one would be pretty handy. Yeah, why not? Yeah, let's go for that. Screw it. Wait, what? Oh, she can still level up. I thought I broke the game for a second. It should be level 15, I think, was their maximum. So it got, it's got a while to go, at least. Done. Okay, so apparently the weird bounty is in this system, perhaps? Ah, in the Delta something system. That's where I am. Perfect. Oh, no. Wait a second. All along the watchtower. That's not good. Ah, that is the fleet. Oh, what is happening? What is that? Oh, what the hell? <laughs> is it shooting lasers at me or something? I want to try something. Can I get it to shoot this fleet? No. Okay, they just want to attack me. Fair enough. We've got these weird funky destroyers. I feel like this might be a bit of a disaster. I can see already it's got two high velocity drivers, but I'm really interested to see what these death ray drones are. And also, of course, if we capture these, we need to take them with us, without a doubt. Try to talk to her? Hey! Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> She's not very friendly, apparently. Not the most uh, telling, talkative person in the world. Let's, uh, at this point, because we've got a bit of a better fleet, I'm going to switch some things around so we have, like, a bit more of a... Actually, I do like this one. Um, I like having, like, 50 guys in each group. Not 50, 50 supplies-ish, so I can split them out a little bit. And what we do with the rest of them, we're putting the group two. There you go. One of these ships, by the way, doesn't actually have up to point anyway, so we can see it. Doesn't actually have any shields. <laughs> so it's a bit dangerous to say the least. Ah, look at her. Isn't that not a glorious ship? So this ship is electromagnetic warfare cruiser. It actually buffs all nearby allies as well as itself when it goes into combat. So it's actually pretty handy just to have it nearby. I like it. I like it. Anyway. Let's see what's happening over here, shall we? Hello? Should we deploy everybody? I'm going to do it. I don't know how strong these guys are. They've got some weird ships. So it's, we'll play it safe and deploy everybody. A lot of flares I'm seeing over there. Take this! Miss. <laughs> I could probably kill the drones before I even get over there. I'm terrified. I don't understand what this is. So my instinct is to just blow it up and not go near it. What are you doing, Matt? Are you crazy? It doesn't seem that bad at the moment. It's kind of the shooting lasers. Interesting. I will point out, this is not the main one. This is the secondary vessel. Not the, uh, where is she? She's trying to somewhere. At least I think she is. There should be a big ship. Ah, is it her? There, that's the ones that I was really worried about. Anyway. Oh, this worked out great. This ship is so good. I can't believe I got pretty much high velocity drivers and heavy maulers on the same ship. It is the perfect... Well, I guess orbs will be better, but this is great. It's a good combination. Well, like I said. K 
Kill them gently. I want to recover these unique ships. I've never seen them before. Caress them into the depths of hell. That's working out great. All my ships are starting to really come together now. They've got like really good setups. They're doing pretty good now. It does take a while to get stuff going in this game. I spend a lot of time just going through all the old um, ship designs and stuff. It's a constant struggle of improvement. No ship's perfect. Unless it happens to have heavy maulers and um, high velocity drivers. Then it is, but still. So is it just... Okay, she's still alive down there. Are oh, the phase ship's going to be a giant pain. Uh, where are my fast ships? Oh, there's also another phase ship. So what we do... What we will do... Are deploy squads of gank units of frigates on all the various... Let's get one of you over there as well. Oh, no, no, don't do that. <laughs> No, oh, oh, what am I doing with my life, everybody? I'm such a failure! Disgusting! Okay, it's fine. Anyway, um, <laughs> you guys go for that one. And we are going for that. That's the plan, everybody. That's the plan. Let's go. Might be a bit overkill, but I don't know how fast they are. So if I just put those random ships on it, one of them is probably faster to keep up. Seem to be out of the range of these weird drones at the moment. Oh, someone's dying. It looks like it's okay though. I gotta back up, I gotta back up. They're hitting me with something powerful. Oh, they got two high velocity drivers. <laughs> That's what is happening over there. Don't die. Oh, it's because he face tanked it. This is the one without the shield, by the way, so it's probably the least useful frigate I have in my navy right now. I'm just gonna keep my distance. <laughs> I'm waiting for my where Where's my waifu? Ah, oh, it's merely a flat wood, it's fine. Okay, let's go, boys. I don't think, no matter how unique this ship is, it's not gonna survive this. <laughs> oh no. It's very tanky though, I gotta give it that. Ah, oh, here we go, yes! Okay, that's that's not very that's, that's not disabling ships, friends. That's that's blowing them up. Have a story point, very nice. And we get both of them. I'll take yeah. The beholder. Very cool. Flare burst launcher. Animator. Nothing too crazy there, but we got some free stuff. I'm pretty well. Let me just make sure these people are firmly set on. 80, 90. How effective are they? Quite low CR, I must admit, uh, ordinance points wise. They do have these weird drones. Maybe it, like it's got equivalent to having like an extra two or three weapons worth. I'm not really sure. Anyway, I will put them both on no no mode. Problem solved. Okay, let's save because I got to try and now escape a system with artillery in. Uh, I don't know what happens if it kills me. Do you know what? For science, should we see what happens? I'm gonna let it hit me. I'll be reload. I just want to see what happens. I'm ready. Punish me. Okay, wait. What? That. What is this gonna do? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh my God! Look at my. Oh no! It broke my ships. Oh no! That's so bad! Repair cost 400! Wow, imagine if this actually hit me when I was playing normally. Well, okay, that's fine. Let's, let's get out of the way of that beam, shall we? <laughs> Ooh! It tracks where I'm going? Oh no, what the hell is this? I'm getting closer, I want to see what it is. Can I kill it this time? Wait, stop, 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 stop. While I'm here. Oh wait, something we can try. Can I actually do a survey here? Because i got my drones now. I need 500 drones! <laughs> Never mind. We're a bit off that. We only got 41. There it is. Target spotted. Four stars now. We're getting closer. We may be able to take one down one day, but not today. We're leaving. Oh, no. I'm not really if I get hit playing normally. I was only just doing it as an experiment. Oh, game. Stop it, game. Stupid memory leaks. It's... Oh. Did that get me? We're okay. How is this still shooting at me? That's what I'm impressed by. 
There is some stuff we might want to do some exploring with. We've got some drones now. It's not like we're completely empty. Uh, watchtower. Okay, whatever. Can I capture these ones? No. There is a mining station, though. Oh! Oh, we got to one of the event points. That's pretty cool. Screw it. We're doing it. Oh! Hover Pulse Weapon Blueprint Package. Now, I want to... I know this is a mod, but I love the graphic this guy's done for this uh, blueprint. This That really stands out. That is great. I love that. And we also got ourselves some Pulse Core things. I don't know what any of these are. Can be installed on capital ships. Interesting. Imperial Targeting Package. Only works on Imperial ships, as you probably would imagine. Uh, we'll take it all. We'll take it all. We have a very large amount of... Um, Target capacity at the moment, so it does work out pretty well. And we got some exo armor. What? Oh, so it's a chip that creates marines. That's quite interesting. I mean, they're they're human meat bags still, but still, it's pretty cool. Oh wait, well I'm here. Get that topography data. Let's get out of here, shall we? So there is actually some missions nearby, but I don't know if they they might be a little bit too powerful. This one though, we could probably take this one. Uh, in a super giant primary star, which is going to be one of these two. Actually, it's no, it's only that one. Let's go this way, shall we? So I'm pretty sure we're getting to the. Ooh, no, I think I've died. Oh god, the system stresses me out. Everybody, I've got to get out of here. Screw this place. I'm out of here. <laughs> Screw that. And we made it. So something I haven't mentioned about this series yet is that mod doesn't just get, let you have the ability to have AI ships. It also means you can make AI... Oh no, it's this system again. I don't want to be here. Oh, wait, was this, this is one of the missiles, right? It wasn't as bad. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Okay, we're clearly finding enemy fleet here. It's coming in. Oh no, that, that, that looks really bad. That's a death. If you get If you go into that, you'll die. Do you know what? Yeah, so if you go near a planet, I can actually create a specific type of colony, which is for robot buildings and robots. I really want to do that. I was going to try and show off the requirements for it, but I just haven't had a chance yet. We'll try and do it after this battle. Hey, buddy! Our red. The most disgusting of reds. I mean, he's got some big ships, but at the end of the day, I'm confident. Uh, oh, wait a second. I just realized something. Oh. <laughs> Medusa, you run in the battle. My bad. Okay, let's get in, everybody. Awesome. So, wait, was that guy's name Uranus? Interesting. Let's take this guy down, shall we? Disgusting meatbag names. Skynet does not approve. Oh, this is perfect. It's already screwed. Well, that was a quick end to this guy. If I say that, maybe not. It's very tanky, but we can get... Come on, keep firing, keep firing. Okay, back up, back up, back up, back up. Oh, oh I, I, I clutched it, I clutched it. Oh, I say that, I'm being absolutely ravaged by this enemy right here. Do you know what? I got away with that, with some really light damage. That should have killed me, I was too aggressive. I'm taking this as a personal win. The uh, flamethrower was a bit dodgy there, but I think it's an anti-armor weapon. So luckily my shield blocks a lot of it, but not all of it. This guy looks like a squidgy boy. I think he's squidgy. Yeah, he's squidgy. We're going in, we're going in. Increase the fire rate! Maybe not, maybe not. If we go for some of the easy kill- Oh dear, that was my bad. I didn't- I thought that was going to, like, dissipate. <laughs> the range is not normally that great, but it, apparently I misjudged it quite badly. Finding me down. Um, okay, I want to go for the ones we can just get rid of. So there's less to deal with. That mule looks like a good target. Let's go for this. It's already being attacked by a lot of my allies as well. Glimmer's down. Well, that was quick. It just died. <laughs> maybe the Glimmer's not the best ship in the world. I think it's pretty fast, actually. So maybe it's just a bit chaotic with its uh, build I put onto it. It's very hard balancing out AI builds. Because sometimes they just get too aggressive and they just kill themselves. Back up. Is that one of those suicide shuttles? <laughs> get him! That's the last human we captured in there. Okay, so I'm not liking it so far. This battle seems a bit standoffish. This thing, I think, is a good target, though. I think we should try and murder this. If I do an engage command, most... Nah, seeing that, I don't want to do that, because they lose their position. We've got a nice little front line right now. 
Uh, what I could potentially do... What is this? What is the speed difference here? Uh, 30 attack. I just want this particular ship to engage a slow ship. It's got really good guns, and it's probably the best DPS we have. Medusa, get in there, buddy. I love the point of defense on this. Get out of the way, Medusa. We need the heavy maulers to activate. Hey, get out of the way. What? Are you going to fight? There you go. That's what I want to see. Look at that damage. We've been, sh like, four of us shooting in the bottom. Like, two or three K. One second, four K. <laughs> That's a beefy ship right there. And, oh, be careful. Should be okay. Santa Man is going down. That's the one without any weapons on it, so it's fine. So the enemy's down. That's great. Uh, I'm going to tell her to go and attack the mule next. Everyone else can do their own thing. They're quick enough. This guy, they're just going to keep backing away from each other. That's fine. That, that big ship's out of the combat, if that's the case. I'll take this down. Oh, it phased away! I can do it more than once as well. Oh, it's going to overload me. I actually got it from that range. It's pretty impressive. Okay, you get... You could, you win this round, AI. You win this round. Unless I have some friends that can catch you. You never know. Okay, well, so well, sapping on this battlefield. So they've reached the target over there. That's a victory. There's no reason for me to go over there. This is a bit dodgy. I'm going to head over this way. Also, there's a shepherd on the way we can kill as well. Leave! Oh, that was perfect. <laughs> Years of experience of playing this game and paying off finally. Or it's my superior programming. Okay, this is one I want to get rid of down here. This ship. If I can just clone this ship and have a fleet of them, this would have been... This is like the best frigate I've ever seen in my entire life. I think it actually is better than the... It's so fast. Massive capacity. I think it's actually better than the Tempest. Although it hasn't got the DPS though, has it? Because it hasn't got the drones. A lot of the DPS in the Tempest is from the drones itself. Oh, no, no, wait, I'll take it all back. There's a Diable Avionic one that transforms into a jet or, like, a combat mode. That is the best frigate I've played, I've used. This is actually not good. This is not good. Go around the back. I haven't got the skills to vent Hard Flux passively yet, so it's a bit dodgy when it comes to these battles. And also, that guy's right behind me. He might have a missile. That's the dead, not good. Oh, that means that big vessel caught them. It probably got to the edge of the map, unfortunately. But very soon, it's just going to be the big vessel left. Yes. Yes. There it is. We're going in. There's a lot of us and not a lot of you. You two should be okay up there, right? Yeah, I think they'll be fine. Well, they are fighting an officer that's level 12. <laughs> Let's get some damage down. What are you doing? <laughs> it's terrible. Get out of there. Idiot. I think I need to switch to fit on that point. It's a very good player ship, but maybe not so much for the AI. I want to try and get rid of this engines. Be careful, Medusa. Okay, it's been a little bit of time, but we've got to a point where it's nearly dead. This thing is ridiculously tanky. Yes, yes, yes. Finish it, finish it, finish it. Oh, come on, man. It keeps doing that skill every time the mauler fires. It's really annoying. We got it. It's done. Woo. Wow, I lost... Uh, the... I don't care about the Salamander. I do kind of care about the Glimmer, though. Let's just see what happens. Let's see what um, the game gives us when it comes to the draw here. <sighs> okay, I, I think we have to get rid of the Glimmer then. I mean, I don't think it's that good in the first place. And do I want to get rid of it? Oh, it's 100% experience though. Now nah, we'll take it, we'll take it, it's fine. I don't really want any of their ships. I get a lot of story points, by the way, because I got like ridiculous amount of it. Um, 
level up psycho doing this. Perfect. I'll take all that. Thank you, game. Another level up as well. Let's go for... We're only one away from getting this, by the way. No, two away, sorry. We're two away from getting the demob removal. Monthly supplies. Oh, sorry, I just ate some paper. That was awful. Uh, this is what we need. 44% reduction. That is amazing. Really, really good. So we'll definitely take that right away. Also, less stuff to survey planets. Amazing. I'll take it. Thank you, game. I guess what we're probably next on, I'm probably going to grab fuel consumption. Just because it is generally very helpful. Oh, no. <laughs> the sloot! The loot! Why is it firing so often? Oh, that counted? No! Oh, it's killed by fleet! We have to get out of it then. I know, we gotta repair it a little bit, then we gotta stop, because otherwise they're gonna start falling apart. Resume repairs. <gasps> get the salvage! It's because I, if, I if I just left, it would have been fine. Yeah, that wasn't worth it. That was. <laughs> was it worth losing 400 supplies? No! Not at all. It was awful. Okay, let's go back to base. Oh, that was such a disappointment. I can't believe I did that. That was so bad. <laughs> I'm leaving. I wanted to show everybody the um, requirements to getting a new planet, though. Actually, can't I do that? Any I can do that anywhere. Wait, let me just go over here. Okay, stop repairing. Oh, I'm so cursed when it comes to being hit by that. That was awful. I guess I thought it was okay, but there must have been like an after effect to going into that area. I need supplies! What's that noise? Oh, the AI is killing each other, it's fine. Hey, friends, I'm here to buy supplies. That should work. Okay, put it back on. Machine repairs, it's okay. We didn't die. <laughs> anyway, that went pretty well. We've got some cool stuff here. I probably should grab the... Yeah, I'm just going to learn them. Why not? We've got some stuff we can sell. I got these blueprints. I can't want to learn all this because I've never seen a lot of the hive stuff. We have seen one of these. Uh, one of these is that big weapon I picked up. I think I still own it. There it is. This guy. The one we had on that really bad Sundra. Um, yeah, I'll take him. I'll take him. Apart from that, I think we're pretty good. So before we do anything else, let me just quickly show you guys a planet, shall I? So you can see what I'm on about. If we go and find one somewhere. This place. I'm not actually going to colonize it, don't worry. Nor can I. So you can see, you can establish a colony at normal. Oh, wrong button. Sorry. I ruined it. I ruined the supply. So you can do a normal colony, which requires the crew, the thing, the supplies, that kind of thing. Or, as you may have saw a second ago, because I'm an idiot, if you press this button, you can create an automated drone colony. Oh. So, these guys, actually, should we read it? Let's see what it says. You consider the possibility of building an automated carny. It will require very different infrastructure than a normal carny and will suffer a slow increase in stability uh, penalty. Oh, interesting. As it grows until such infrastructure is present in the sector. The carny will not be able to rely on normal immigration to grow, but will instead have to rely on drone operated factories. Oh. Once properly supplied, the program nature of the machines will provide a boost to stability. Drone factory output should eventually be upgradable enough to supply other automated colonies resulting in faster colony growth this looks awesome i cannot create wait i cannot wait to, to create this thing now of course um we need seven more sub command nodules tons of salvage drones and a little bit of supplies and heavy machinery i say what we do i kind of need to do some stuff anyway like what we do we will is this even on <laughs> Out of transmit silence. Okay, let's just grab some random stuff. Which is not here. Or here. Damn it. <laughs> we need this stuff anyway, though. So I'll buy a few. Oh, it's very expensive, though. I'll just keep it going in the background. It might take us an episode to get there, I think. Because it's quite a lot of stuff we need. But yeah, I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be fun. Oh, there's a Heron. Ooh. Tempting. And also a Vulture. Now this. Be a fun ship to fly around. 
Point defense drones. Hmm. I'll think about it. I kind of like it flying exotic ships if I'm using mods, so I'll look out for more of those. I probably should make sure I check all these um, bounties as well while I'm here. Oh, wow! <laughs> I can take that! I'm joking. I can't take that. Wait, I know. I want to go back to the bounty board. No, that's not how I want to... Okay, it's fine. Wow, look at this ship! Oh, this game is so cool. I love all this stuff. Even the one that's like only worth 300 grand, death. <laughs> Instant death. If you go to it, you die. Why, security codes? No, thank you. There's also a guy doing targets for missions. Very manageable, but also very far away. So I'm not as excited. Oh, that one's really close, but it's the one that will kill us. So <laughs> maybe not, maybe not. Okay, I'm going to go back to base. What I'll do... Is there any mountains I can do on the way? Is there small ones I can grab? There's an America. No, there's a uh, thing going on over there. There is actually a faction bounty in this location. Should we give that a shot and see what we can do? Before I leave, though, can I see if there's any shuttles here? So we've got a salvage gantry, which might be a good idea to grab in general. I've got some spare money right now. This is what I was on about earlier. This is what we need. Yes. I think this is well. So we know that the drone uh, production is based off cargo uh, crew capacity converted. So this is going to be epic. So if I go AI retrofit, plus 3.8 production. That's like three times or four times what I currently have in my Navy already. That is great. Brilliant. We'll take that. And also we've got this guy, which gives us... What did it do again? Increases efficiency of... Just doing stuff. And also pro battle salvage. Pretty cool. I, at one point, did this used to repair your fleet faster? Am I thinking back to the day, guys? Is that like three or four years ago? At one point, there used to be ships that increase the efficiency of your, like, your ships repairing and stuff. But I, I'm yeah, I'm too old. What can I say? I played this game for too long. Does this also have the... Oh, wait. Can we do the same thing here? Uh, Wait, where is it? I'm blind. So blind. Game says no. Okay, it actually has nothing on it. I can't do anything with that. Does it have cargo capacity? But if it does, it's now higher. <laughs> I just found a quick payday here. This guy just randomly wants to buy fuel, so I'm just going to accept it. <laughs> and then done. Wait, is it that easy? Oh my god, what a great, what a great day. There you go, I just made loads of money. <laughs> Sorted. And I, what I'm going to do, I'm going to buy it back. Wait, how much does it cost me to do that? I made like a very tiny amount of profit there, but it wasn't too exciting. Anyway, while I was messing around with the menus and stuff, a new mission appeared. Now, I don't know if I put it in the video because I happened to cut and do a lot of things. I have found a new MVS bounty. Like, oh, whatever. Remember, I want to join them as a commission. I'm currently on 8 out of 10 points. If I go over here and do this, I can definitely join them and also get more money at the same time. They have a, where is it? Dwarf Primary Star. It's there. It's that one. What could be that one? We'll find out in a second. Just jumped in the old slipstream. Is this an enemy? Oh, we're going to kill it on the way over. Yeah! <laughs> what happens if you fight a battle in the slipstream? Oh, I can't wait. I've never done this before. Let's see what happens. It's actually apparently a full battle. Interesting. I probably should have equipped some of these other ships so they can join us in the battles, but I, I didn't have enough money, so it's okay. Deployment! Oh, it seems to be the same. Oh! Oh, scared, that scared me. <laughs> because um, what I would recommend is they do like the thing where like you just get drifted along the map the whole time. Based on the like, if, if it's going forward, everyone would just be being shoved forward. I mean, it'd be pretty funny. Anyway, this could actually be a bit of a challenging battle. They're scavengers, so we might find a very large variety of various things in this battle. I got this. I missed. Damn it. Sometimes I can pull off like really cool shots. This ship's just a suicide ship, isn't it? What are you doing? Get get back. Go and defend, um, go and defend the Medusa. He's gonna get killed by a Gemini. How embarrassing is that? Do you know I just realized? My Salamanders aren't on auto fire mode. That's why they weren't shooting. <laughs> Idiot. Looking pretty good. I've actually, uh, it might be a bit weird. I actually am slowly changing my ship. I've actually got two armored bullet guns now for the anti armor. So they're actually quite a lot better than they were at the start of the video. I think I only had one, or maybe none. I've been finding some cool stuff as we've been going around, so. 
Excellent, that's that enemy down. The Venture is going to be the last guy to take down, I think. Um, should we just start the battle now? Let's go for it. Begin the shooting. I got your back, friend. We aim at the same spot so we can break through the onion level of defense the Venture has. This would be another good thing to capture, by the way, because it has... Um, 300 cargo capacity, uh, crew capacity, so it's actually pretty good if I make it into a robot forge. Quite a few defense drones here. Everyone else seems happy. Everyone's winning their battle. Is that a Imperial frigate? Why is that here? <laughs> Bit random. Pretty fun fashion to play. I played them, uh, well, actually, you probably know if you watched my videos before. I played them a few times. I did it last, this time last year, I did the Imperial series. Fun times. Although I remember that damn siege ship that used to keep shooting me at the back. It, don't don't recruit siege ships. They're actually your enemies, trust me. Yeah, this guy still has hull. This is absolutely ridiculous. We are winning though. Um, it'd be probably be good if I help what I do. I'll switch out from here. That venture's not going to kill my friend there. I'm going to go and deal with the other enemies. And then the rest of my fleet can move in and help us out here. This we get a big swarm at the end so we can take down the venture quickly. It is a giant onion. It takes ages to kill normally. My eyes being very passive though. I hear they come. Join me, friends. Oh, that's not good. That's not, that's bad. That's bad. Yeah, I think we're okay. Yeah, because the Imperial ships have like different modes. They can be like elite packages, long range, loads of different things. I think it's a really awesome idea. They're all very modular. Oh, here we go. That's what I want to see. Glimmer just died pretty much. Where is the Glimmer? Is it dead? Oh, there it is. How does this keep happening to the ship? <laughs> I think it's killing itself or something. I don't know what's going on there. Ah, they got all my stuff just turned off. What a disaster. Good luck, men. I'll be back later. Uh, yeah, when I say later, I mean a lot later, apparently. Oh, it's because the inbuilt repairs take a lot longer, doesn't it? Well, that's awkward. Uh, okay, it's working again. <laughs> uh, we've got to be careful. They're actually about to escape. They're getting close to the end of the battle, and they're probably going to try and just leave. Take it down, guys. Fire faster. Uh, can you... F there you go. That's what I want to see. Fire your guns. Unfortunately, we're hitting a bit that has a button. Dude, get out of the way. Yes. Come on. Beautiful. Oh, here comes the civilians. <laughs> Kill the civilians. Yes, we captured them. Kill the meatbags. This is a Cylon moment right now. We're just going to nuke all the civilians. Don't worry about it. I hope be careful with this fuel tanker though, it might blow up and kill me. <laughs> Let's maybe keep a little bit of distance here. Maybe ramming it is not the best idea. There you go, big explosion. That one might get away. Let's see what we can do here. Oh, I'm reloading it. Come on, little guy, take it down. Yeesh. Yeah, we got it, we got it. That was a lot of them dead. We hopefully got a lot of their cargo there. Nice. Uh, Bashu lets us send these guys off. Rapid speed mode. Kill my enemies. They're all dead. Um, I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling any of these. We'll leave them be. Oh, I got some okay stuff, I guess. It wasn't too exciting. I like it if there's a chance you could pick up AI calls from scavengers. Actually, is that a thing? I think it would be. We've leveled up, though. What is this? <laughs> what kind of cursed image is this? Who was that? <laughs> anyway, um, go grab that fella. Can I scavenge in the, this? No, I can't. It won't, it won't let me. <laughs> in fact, I'm stuck in here forever now. I can never leave. Whoa, uh, I gotta get out of it. Get to the side. Fight the stream. This is too much. I'm just gonna fly normally. It's fine. Oh no, I was apparently too fast. Never mind. Oh, I tell you why. I've I haven't got this yet, have I? Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> that should normally be okay, but not today. 
Everyone repaired and happy? Are we all current? Wait, what's this? <laughs> Trait suggestion. Doomed. <laughs> Where is that? Well known for being doomed. Negative 30% recovery chance. I'm not sure about that, to be honest. What was the alternative? I mean, as well as it is being doomed. Weak shields. Oh, no, that's a terror. It will be doomed if I do that. No, thank you. It's fine. We just gotta hope it never dies in combat. Oh, not again. No, game. Stop doing this to me. Oh, so this one's okay. This one's okay. These are interdiction missiles. Yeah, I don't care about that. It's fine. Uh, though it does mean I can't get close to the enemy now. It's so annoying. Okay, I'm back at full speed. Let's do this. Yes, yeah, this is definitely the calmest artillery. It doesn't actually do anything. It's just minor inconvenience. So I'm looking for a dude. Oh, that's the enemy. Hey, buddy. Not, not you, though. That's probably them there. Will it hit the AI? I'm kind of curious to see if it will hit the AI. Oh, I guess we're just fighting a guy. Oni Chan's going to try and take us down. Let's do this. This should be an easy battle, I think. I didn't check the star rating, but I didn't think he had anything too dangerous, so... Oh, this thing. Oh, God, I forgot about these. We got this guy. Does it have shields? Oh, it's got the really weird red ones. Damn it, man! <laughs> Go and defend something! I've got to remember to give you a mission every... I'm going to give you just escort missions every time you fight, okay? Go and escort the Falcon. I mean, you might save her life one day. It wasn't like ever in a very intelligent AI commander. <laughs> that's being led by Gamma Core. They're all Delta Cores, that's the Gamma Core. Okay, she's gone right in for it. Oh no, that's she's fighting the um This fella. Looking pretty good though. Okay, Alice is having a bad day. Uh, where is he? Oh, he's been covered. It's fine. Don't flux me. Oh, I think he tried to escape, but it just kind of fell apart there. Ah, oh, long range score launchers. Very annoying. Can you start your attack on that fella? I'm going to just bypass. I'm going to try and take down this guy trying to escape. Excellent. Good to see. Okay. I'm on my way! Are you- you're still du why are you soloing somebody all of a sudden? Get out of there, man. I like how we have three frigates killing a single shepherd over there. <laughs> Not sure what's going on. Can we need these shuttles to get out of the way? Um, simply. Leave it, it's fine. We're through, we're through. Are you sure you want to get this close to me? Are you sure about this? The wolf made a grave mistake. I got killed? Surprised by that. You think it would be able to escape because it's a frigate. A bit too far away here. Ah, you killed my friend. You must pay for that. We're still one single point away from having this infinite reload. Oh, no, no, not good, not good. Oh, they got Reaper torpedoes. Four seconds. Okay, go, go, go. Move, move, move. I need some assistance, friend. Okay, we're good, we're good. He could have killed me. I don't know why I was spared instant destruction, but I was. He can still kill any of us, though. If he just launches all four at the same time, I don't care what ship it is, it's going to die in this fleet. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Don't kill the Medusa. He's got two left. I think they killed the big ship. Oh, I'm not paying attention, am I? Sorry. <laughs> I've been recording all day. I need to get some breakfast or something. It's fine. Oh, no. This 
okay. And victory. Perfect. So apart from losing one ship, I think that went pretty well. And it's it's curse. I think we might leave the Alistair at this point. I'm sorry, I don't want to keep burning through story. Oh, I've got loads of them. Screw it, it'll be fine. <laughs> I've got more than 20, it's okay. We'll try and get some better ships in the future anyway, though. Um, let's see. So I'll take all this. We are actually over capacity now, which is uh, the first time in a while. And I didn't level up. Fair enough, but my AI has, though. Let's see what my wife who been... Uh, AI programming wants to say. Let's see. So. Point defense would be a good shout in any large ship. And also you can increase the range by making elite if I wanted to. Um, I think that's the best option. Point defense. Target analyst. Looking pretty good. AI friend. Um, let's go for combat endurance. And that's it. <laughs> that's all we need. Victory. Yeah, we do a quick assess the damages here. We get some more stuff back. A bit, bit too much though. And we're done. So this means when I go back to, I'll start next episode or try to in the, the nearest sector. We will be able to get ourselves a commission, which should hopefully is massively increase the speed of doing things. But you know. Well, apart from that, everybody, thank you for watching this episode. As always, please like, subscribe, and comment below, and I'll see you next time. Bye.